Now children, in this video, we will see some questions based on Fajan Sul. Let's summarize once again. According to Fajan Sul, polarization is direct version to covalent character. More the polarization, more will be the covalent character. And obviously, lesser will be the ionic character. Now, what did Fajan say? What all factors govern? We have seen. Just in short, a small cation and big anion. More will be the polarization. This point you have in the last video and we'll explain to you. And more will be the covalent character. Or say opposite. Big cation and small anion. Lesser will be the polarization and more will be the ionic character. Now, some of the questions given to you out of NaCl, MbCl2 and AlCl3. They are in the same period, you know, and uh, they have the same anion Cl, chloride, which is most ionic in nature. How will you answer? I don't know. There are also some other factors also with the help of which you can answer. But if they ask you, explain in terms of Fajan Sul. Sometimes they specify also. And they say, arrange them in the increasing order of the ionic character with reason. So children, here Na, you know, the biggest in size and one charge. Here Mg are moving left to right, size decreases and the two positive charge further decreases, means smaller in size. A and you are further moving that side, size smaller plus three charges over are there. As the positive charge increases, size decreases. So Na plus the largest, Mg2 plus in between and Al3 plus the smallest. So smaller cation, maximum polarization means will have maximum covalent character and so opposite it will have the least polarization and will have the maximum ionic character according to Fajan Sul. So we'll say according to Fajan Sul this will have the greatest polarization and hence maximum covalent character and why greatest polarization because the smallest size of the cation out of these three. Similarly so they say arrange it is the arrangement there. Then children, suppose the size also similar, almost same, charge also same. Then how will you say which out of the two given compounds will be more ionic in nature? Like in case of CuCl and NaCl, maybe you don't know, we are reporting, we are telling you in the question, suppose, that uh, they both have nearly same size and of course same charge Cu plus and Na plus. So which will be more covalent in nature or which will be more ionic in nature? So as I told in my last video, the one which has got zero stable configuration will have more of polarization and more of covalent character. We know Na will be having octet complete while in this case I have shown in the, my last video uh, Cu was having zero stable configuration. It was Its third shell was completely filled. Only 4s electron was taken out. Right? So third shell is completely filled. Hence stable configuration but not the octet. So whenever we have such cases, they also show more of polarization. Cu plus has zero stable configuration. Then children, they ask you another question. Uh, out of Na plus, Mg2 plus and Al3 plus, which will have greatest, just the cations they give you, uh, which will show the maximum polarization or which will have the maximum polarizing power. Al3 plus will have the maximum polarizing power. And Na plus will have the least polarizing power. This type of questions you are asked based on Fajan Sul. Uh, often they ask you with reason. They say which will be more ionic and least according to Fajan Sul. So this is all for Fajan Sul. For this video, we stop here. Thank you, children.